uh, with uh, Junior Kanye. Utleinman is here. Uh, but more importantly, though, that important game that we're chatting to Percy Dow about, uh, Bafana Bafana up against uh, the Zambia national team. Um, I think we all remember everybody's missing him, former Pirates coach, and now doing wonders with the Zambia national team coach, uh, Micho Shredojevic, joins us in studio. Bob, welcome to the show. Thank you very much. It's my honor, pleasure, and privilege to be here with two of you football people around me. I feel like fish in the water. No ways. No ways. Who will be the water? You or Junior? <laughs> Who will be the fish? You're the big fish right now. Firstly, congratulations. Great victory against uh, South Africa. I'm in a game where it had to take a lot from you to come from a position of being behind to then claim an equalizer, to claim a victory. Uh, what to tell you, uh, first of all, even before coming to South Africa for the last 20 years, I'm servant and soldier of African football and following South African football, not being physically maybe here, but my soul is around. All these players that uh, have been called to Bafana Bafana, I know from the time when they first time kicked the ball, from the stories with the people I have worked with, through following and whatsoever, and in any way, I really needed to go to the deepest possible detail in order to prepare exactly moments that are uh, making and change that led to that. One of the most important aspects was that even in moment when we considered that goal, we have not given up, we have really shown the character. And I had uh, a group of so-called firefighters, I call them. They are the players playing a local league that are hungry, thirsty, uh, and uh, with mad desire to give the best, preparing for the Chan in Cameroon in January. And it worked uh, exactly the details that we have followed, uh, because I need to be sincere with you, uh, all of us, we are struggling football now, and football before COVID-19, they are not the same. Uh, you have seen even recently in England, seven goals uh, Liverpool conceding. That is something unthinkable yeah. before. Yeah. But now football has gone in different direction. And we have exactly planned to the aspect uh, that I also heard, uh, despite not exactly understanding the words, but in between uh, the lines trying to understand. Yeah. Uh, that we have played very important role in moment uh, when we have been one mil nil down. Uh, impact of fresh legs of our players worked much better than impact of fresh legs of Bafana Bafana players. And exactly there was the passage where we used, uh, capitalized, but I don't want to blow out of proportion. I don't want to exaggerate. I want uh, to tell that uh, Zambia, uh, really appreciate South Africa th that you are giving us a handle support to have this match because this match is valued more than 50 training sessions. Sure. No training session you could set that could help you in this way. Mm -hmm. uh, match could go either way, it help us. It was like two boxers punching each other uh, in an open game in any way. And uh, I think people have enjoyed. It has helped us mentally uh, to set and tune us for the matches against Botswana in November that I mean is so much to us. Mm -hmm. Two African Cup of Nations we have missed. We have lost first two matches, co uh, scoring one and conceding seven. Now we are building a momentum and with absence of two crucial players, um, Enoch Weppo and Pat Sondaka playing in Red Bull Salzburg in UEFA Champions League. We believe that we shall have the squad that will have what it takes to get the points and return us in contention for the Africa Cup of Nations. And it's an important phase, though, because like you were saying, uh, peeling off what uh, Junior was talking about early on, just the strength that came through and how you were able to manage your bench as opposed to what is happening on the field. Because just uh, before you made the substitution, Sikombe had uh, a great chance, yes. you know, in the box, jersey number 14, Junior. Yes. He, he could have killed it off then, but you managed to manage that situation well up until you brought him off and who to bring in was going to be important. And all of a sudden, the game dynamic changed and you were able to play your pressing game. You were able to overload the wing where South Africa had made their substitution. Tell me about that, because I can see from your expression that... <laughs> 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 Look, they were, they were making the change with Innocent Maela coming. Yeah. Uh, and you know him very, very well, oh, obviously. Of course, yeah. with Nodada and Wala coming and whatsoever. And uh, 
generally, uh, I, I want to tell you, South African players as, a per, as a hypersensitive players, they, they make one very serious mistake when they come inside. Mm. To myself, I'm telling to my impact of fresh legs players, w w when the game starts, you need spiritually to play that game uh, to see where we are lacking and where we are leaking. Hmm. Uh, so that spiritually you are present inside. Do a an, an proper warm-up, come, and first, what you need to do before playing football, you need to be extremely aggressive to get the temperature of the game, uh, very simple to get confidence of the game, and then do what coach has told you to do. Uh, I have not seen this from the players that m uh, my colleague uh, Molef and Seki mm. put because they have come in in a relaxed way thinking I it will happen the way mm. they want yeah. things to do. But with me, I have really psyched the players in a way when, they, when you are coming, your special command of for uh, forces uh, to uh, change the game in direction we are supposed so that because when the game starts, it's 100% both teams. Mm -hmm. When the game goes, it goes down. And then impact of fresh legs make you going up or down. In our case, it works. And I really want in expelling the captain of the national team after uh, Kenya friendly yes uh, and I need to tell people z in Zambia they are talking and even people have commented internationally how it could happen you know Zambia in two matches of uh, qualifiers and against Kenya conceded nine goals in three matches three per match yeah. and that chemistry in central defense didn't work and I measure the player in the national team number one how he becomes in the camp mm -hmm. we, how, how he correlates with younger players how he accommodates them what he does in that aspect I look how he contributes as a professional in big team like TP Mazembe uh, in the training uh, giving an uh, really role model and positive example uh, way and then in the matches contribution and all these three things were lacking with the captain of the national team Kabaso so I wanted to try an, a new chemistry in central defense and overall with the team. It worked as a shocking aspect because the uh, uh, point is that nobody is not above the national team, nobody is not bigger than the jersey of nation and as a such uh, it worked and in the future we shall see how things will go but for me sorting the issues in the dressing room sorting the human relations that have leaded that a big footballing nation like Zambia that has won Africa mm -hmm. Cup of Nations 2012 and missed 2017 and 19 and lost first two matches first thing that we need to sort is uh, chemistry in the within dynamics us, as well the, the the dynamics yeah, in, yeah, yeah. in within the team, people to feel a cult of national team. This is something what, for example, uh, Bafana Bafana had in 1996. As I say mm -hmm. uh, from his side, um, it has kind of evaporated. But I really wish, because I believe me, in neutral way as a person, uh, I have come to South Africa, but I have accepted you, your culture, tradition, style of life, habits, uh, your past, your past, your present, and looking into your future. I believe that you have everything. Mm -hmm. That cult of national team need to come back. For me, is very strange. And when, in, I don't know whether it's still existing, but I know before that you, ha you, you are having something called a match appearance fee. This is not existing nowhere in Afri or in African continent. You're playing for your nation with your heart. Give the top bonuses for the winning. Mm -hmm. But appearance fee, this is something. Listen, uh, this is payback for what nation, uh, 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 mm -hmm. for what football has given you, where you have grown, returning to. Because f uh, so football. For, for Zambia, the, you, you didn't give any appearance fee. So huh? <laughs> let me tell you. Uh, nothing you are having uh, you are having to play n not appearance fee yes your appearance fee is honor pleasure and privilege playing for your nation We're in the but then when it's question of bonuses right. this is where you need to put because pl players need to be motivated in any way and uh, I, I did not intend in negative way mm. towards Safa towards mm. coach towards players but I believe uh, you need to put puzzles in the right mosaic because I believe there is not strong African football without South Africa putting strong food there and showing. You have everything what it takes to be there and I uh, as a uh, 
person that uh, respects the people, love this country, uh, I really wish this to happen in times ahead of us. Hmm. Junior Kanye has been listening. Yeah. And uh, I want your reaction, especially what he talked about when he, remember we were talking about Ama, Ama reserves and what you bring out of mm. the bench. And he mentioned the two L's. You look at what you're lacking and what you're leaking. Mm. So, as So, first of all, uh, I, I love, I, I like to, to, to compliment the coach for men enough. You, you heard him when he's saying there was a, a captain that was appointed by Zambia national team here to came, mm. come and, and look at that captain and obvious when the research, he did the research with that captain and then he find those three elements that he was looking at, he lacked all of them mm. and then he had to let him go. And it shocked the national team and, and somebody. The nation. I'm yeah. saying the nation as well. The nation, yeah. And then he had to approach somebody, uh, 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 and then it was different. But it takes a real man. Mm. It tells you a national team in South Africa that uh, as a coach, is here, the sub that he's doing, if you must really coach. Yet the coach, he, he, it's very important as a player when you put him on the bench. Mm. Uh, uh, I like the national team, the selection first, I love. Uh, I, 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 I've never watched that. Uh, those players in their teams but in the, in the same day uh, i couldn't see uh, those players coming from the pens i'm saying about dropping the game mm. in terms I, I, I zambia the way they started when those players came the intensity goes up mm. it tells you the depth and the readiness you map they take it serious on the bench they told themselves that I, I, i'm not on the bench i'm here to study i could listen to the coach now when he's saying uh, on the he want when you when you bring this up is very important for him to warm up properly mm -hmm. and also to study where the game is lacking. I need to add the spark. I need to do one, two, three, four. And then the instructions when the calls come, you're able to do that. Mm -hmm. Because the intensity was very high. Mm -hmm. Those players, they came, they dropped the game. And in the sensitive position, here in the spine, mm -hmm. is Mvala. And the confidence was low. Mvala didn't have a, confi a, a, a confidence. You bring him to Zambia. Remember how he was dispossessed? The goal number two. Exactly. Yeah. 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 So, so you could tell that the intensity was, was the instruction there. Yeah. Dispossessed quickly, he couldn't track back to it's go and retrieve. Because yeah. he definitely showed he received the ball facing his ball. And then the speed, there was a the speed. Mm -hmm. And intensity tells you, Izamba, that they wanted to score. Yeah. And I love the coach, but I, I told you, Khutman. I saw the, the camera showed the, the, the coach when they, they were losing one nil. And then uh, go to, 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 mm -hmm. to motivate his players. Mm -hmm. It takes a real, another coach. Other coach is panicking. Mm -hmm. They're playing away. He was going to panic and say, why making shout that players? But he motivate, he's got to believe with those players. And those players, it themselves individually you can see the body language mm -hmm. they, they they wanted that game most even themselves except the coach and the difference definitely between them and south africa they wanted mostly yes. because the talent in south africa they you could see they play with one game from the first we see there was no like a, a, a sense of agent in the last ten. Mm -hmm. they play with same care passing to all most backwards mm -hmm. sideways backwards and the coach what is that's what i'm saying first half i could see mm -hmm. states mm -hmm. first in south africa Two shots on target, it just passes down. Mm. You understand? Mm. And then in Zambia, more than number seven. It tells you the, the way you are playing now determine your future. Yeah. It tells you if Zambia, I said it to me now, when I was asked somewhere, I was watching mm. the game, Namanyama journalist, and they asked me, I told them that Zambia will win this game. Mm. Even if South Africa is score, but Zambia, even last 20 minutes, they asked, I said they will win. Because they wanted to push more. The way they were playing, which would be in most cases, they, were play, they play behind defense in mm. South Africa. They turn defense to Ngutiba above face mm. It was most of three against two. Because South Africa full packs, I think the coach has studied. When they put to Mayela, he knows of Mayela <laughs> in our <laughs> hand. He knows too well. Yeah, honestly, yeah, yeah. tactically, South Africa on the side. In Kulmanga, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a right back mm. and left. Tactically, poo, I'm sorry to say that. Mm. They go and sometimes both. And if so that's where you watch Kapamba, Mulanga, when they came in. Uh, Mubanga. Mubanga. Kapamba. So when they came through, and even just the involvement of the bench, even during those water breaks, it, it's almost like they are part of the playing 11, how they get involved. Yeah. So it makes your job easier because already that hunger is established from the bench before they come on. Mm -hmm. And when to mark... And you were taking on what uh, Junior was talking about. But like it's dispossessed. And where does that go? Turn it around. Difficult to track back. Difficult to mark again. Ends up in the back of the net. Why? Because, again, 
utilization of the ball, how it's crossed into the box, miss kick at times, whatever from South Africa, they create their own mistakes, but you capitalize on it. Give me your thinking in terms of when and where and how, and given the tempo and the shortcomings that you know South Africa had. Um, uh, look, it's really unfair me. Uh, I have the highest degree of respect to the coach, respect yeah. to, to, to football here. And now to try, it's easy to be the general after the battle, you know. Yeah. And now to speak and boost and whatsoever. I, I have not come he no, here just for, to for, learn, just for, to for, for, for the time, yeah, Chesty. But first thing that I w I w when I'm speaking about, I will look at the chemistry in central defense, for example. Uh, for me, I would never put Tyson right and uh, Monteca Madisha left uh, due to uh, experience, captain, you are putting him left, uh, right footed stopper on the left side with less experience. This is first element. Second element uh, that I have seen is uh, due to the fact that uh, league recently finished. Players have switched off after how many 60 days going, uh, having families and whatever. Yeah. So it was like a balloon that is a bit lacking air mm. in a way. So the way people have reported to camp and whatsoever, the way I heard even from the coach and also and see with my own eyes, you know, because I, uh, you have supporters are looking where, where is the ball. Uh, uh, people liking the players look at only their players yeah. but us technical people we are looking at all the pictures appearing in front of us and when you look at that picture I have seen in the body language that I have not seen except maybe Percy that is in competitive aspect mm -hmm. that the rest of the players are far from their uh, competitive level of the form. Uh, sharpness, we are, uh, eh? sharpness <laughs> in, in that aspect. So maybe match has come in an, a wrong time. Um, I deeply regret uh, and I really don't know what happened with uh, Lyle Foster because he's my boy from Pirates yeah. uh, that went I uh, immediately out. I deeply regret that situation. It was really, I, I apologize in the name of my player and, and, and us because it is really friendly match and, and, and I feel for it. I don't know which way uh, would go if he was inside to have, because you, all four players up front, you had their, uh, let me say so, low gravity uh, players, low gravity players that aerially hardly to, is meaning they are putting you down. So all focus you are putting down to press as high as possible, to limit uh, passes to them, to not uh, allow appearance of the pockets in front of your defense from where if Percy takes you in isolation, you are finished. If uh, um, Keegan is taking you in isolation, you are finished. So uh, exactly those are the elements because I, I didn't look at South African players as opponents. I, yeah. I feel them as my own kids, mm -hmm. yeah. as my own players in any way. Home. No matter yeah. whether they are sundowns, pirates, from where they are, ever they are coming, I look at them in different way because over the years, even when uh, Co uh, Stuart Baxter was around, yeah. I have been very close to him, especially in preparation for the Libya and whatsoever, and challenges and problems and looking at and being a supporter because I have been part of the game here. And still from the far, I'm, I'm uh, respectfully looking and I believe that uh, it, uh, so, uh, Bafana Bafana has two matches against Sao Tome and Principe. Mm -hmm. This is uh, in the time when the league will properly start and form will lift up and in two crucial matches against Sudan away and Ghana at home. Uh, I, I believe a six-pointer against Sao Tome and Principe is very crucial. Uh, this will give them confidence for more after beating Sudan to have nine points and this then brings you that even draw away in Sudan is taking you to Africa Cup of Nations. But to go to Africa Cup of Nations, not to be just uh, participant, yeah. uh, South Africa need to be contender. Yeah. And I really wish you have everything and I'm from distance uh, supporter. I really wish you all the best. Yeah. No, thank you so much, Coach, because the, the, the main thing, again, is also with all our Zambian nationals that are watching, and a lot of them do watch the show, um, how will you conduct your camp now as we approach the 9th of November and the 17th of November? You've got uh, Botswana home and away in both of those dates. Um, it's crucial 
the one thing you've always said, even when you were still coaching Uganda, is I want to take those boys to the World Cup. And it's the same thing that you said again to me earlier.